Hi, today I'll show you a really simple and effective way to create an eye-catching thumbnail. Without further ado, let's get started. To create our thumbnail, we'll need two free tools. The first one is Whisk AI, an awesome free tool that lets you generate any image you want just by writing a prompt. The second is Canva. We'll use Canva mostly to add text to our thumbnail. First, type Whisk AI into Google and click on the exact website I show. If you're logged into your Gmail account, registration will be almost automatic. Just scroll down and click continue. In this field, we type our prompt, which lets the AI generate the perfect image for our thumbnail. I've prepared a perfect prompt template that works for most YouTube niches. You just need to swap out a few key things like subject, emotion, action, and background. Let's go back to Whisk AI and generate our first image. Let's say I want to create a video called How to Make Pancakes. My sample prompt would look something like this. Of course, you can find all the prompts in the video description. Now just click the little arrow and your image will be created in a second. The result looks pretty good, but I want the left side of the background to be a little darker, so I'll generate it one more time. Okay, I really like this new image, it's much better than before. To download it, just hover your mouse over it and click the icon in the top right corner. Before we move to Canva, let me show you one more example so you really get the idea. Let's say I want to make a fitness video called A Mistake That's Ruining Your Workout. The prompt here could be something like this. So now, just like before, let's generate the image. Our images don't look bad, but since I want to add white text in Canva, I'll try changing the background in the prompt to a solid dark color. I think it would just fit better here. Honestly, I like the image on the left more, so I'll pick that one. To download, just click the same icon as before. So, now that our images are saved, let's just move on to Canva. But before we start in Canva, I've got a small bonus for you. A strong thumbnail is important, but it's only the beginning of your YouTube journey. That's why I've prepared a free video training for you. There, you'll discover how to generate passive income in three simple steps, without needing a thousand subscribers or monetization enabled. If you're interested, just sign up using the link in the description. Now let's get back to our main tutorial. In Canva, start by clicking Social Media, then YouTube, and finally YouTube Thumbnail. Now upload the image you created before and fit it to the right size in Canva. If you want your thumbnail to get a high CTR, the title shouldn't be generic like How to Make a Pancake. Try something more eye-catching. For example, Pancakes in 10 Minutes. On the left menu, click Text. Then, add a heading. Now you can change the font and text size. I think it looks good this way. No need to keep adding more headings. You can just create one, then copy and change the text as needed. I always like to use Canva's lift effect. It makes a soft shadow behind the letters which adds strong contrast, especially on lighter backgrounds, and makes your text stand out. In my opinion, this thumbnail looks great compared to the competition in our niche. Of course, always keep experimenting. It doesn't cost anything and you can learn a lot. All the prompt examples from today's video are in the description below. If you like this video, check my other tutorials and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.